Good morning. I started a vlog clip yesterday and just didn't vlog for the rest of the day. I met up with Jade and she was just like, I really don't want to be in the vlog. I was like, it's fine, don't worry about it. I'll just vlog around us. So we went out to, we went to town to do some returns from the post office, had a little bit of a wander around, went to Superdrug, got some new like hair. It's like a foamy mousse. It's a Cantu one. And I will show you later if, I was going to say if someone reminds me, but if I remember to, I will show you later. I'm on my way to work now. I haven't been working as many hours because our kitchen's been closed and behind the scenes dramas, you know. <laughs> I literally can't afford to put my car through its MOT this month because I'm not getting paid because I haven't been working because there's been no hours to have. So I'm really fucking hoping that my other car comes back from its like it's getting welding done. So I don't have it at the moment, but it's literally MOT exempt and tax exempt, so it's cheaper. Yeah, myself stressed out thinking about it. So not gonna think about it. I'm just going to go to work. I'm going to plug my phone into the auxiliary and just have a little sing song, have a cup of tea. I'll feel better after a cup of tea. I think this might be the intro to the vlog. <laughs> I haven't decided yet. But well, I'm at work now. Oh, lighting. I'm at work now, so I'm going to go in and do my job and hopefully get paid. I will get paid for it. I just won't get paid a lot because there's no tips, because there's no fucking food. Hi, hair's a state, Mowgli's here. Um, I haven't filmed anything for the rest of the day. I left work at three. I haven't filmed anything else. I did tidy up the plant shelves a little bit. Let's take you over. Like this is a bit tidier. This looks bushier, but it needed watering, so I've watered it. I've untangled a little bit because it was really tangly. Uh, I've put all the spider plants together and my variegated monster, which is showing a little tiniest bit of growth, like the tiniest bit of growth. So fingers crossed by spring we might have more than just a little nub <laughs> on of like growth because there's like a whole leaf. I did these the other day, put these on the vines, put this on the moss pole. Oh no, my TV's going to turn off. I'm watching Adam's stream. Hi Adam, you're in the vlog. <laughs> He's doing a 12 hour charity stream, so I've got that on. Had it on like pretty much for the most of the afternoon while I was doing stuff. I mean, I did the washing up, I've done like, done bits. <laughs> it's Mitchell's outside in his car, I can hear his music playing, so he's going to come in in a minute. We're going to have tacos for dinner because it's Thursday, so it's Taco Thursday. <laughs> Normally we do Taco Tuesday, but I'm going to see my car tomorrow. <sighs> Hi, Mowgli. He looks so angry. <laughs> well, I'm going to see my car tomorrow. I don't know if it's a... Uh, we should go and see the car and see that it's done, it's ready, it's great. Or we should go see the car. It needs a lot more work. Um, so we'll find out tomorrow which, which way it will be, whether it'll be a good or a bad or something in the middle. Hopefully it'll be a good and it'll be like, we've done it. Or it'll be a bad and it'll be a, your car's fucked, you need to put another couple of grand into it. But can't afford my MIT at the end of the month for my other car, so hopefully it'll be a good one and I can, you know, bring it home. Probably not though. We'll see. Hi, hello. It's, I don't know what day it is. Friday? It's Friday today. <laughs> Today's the day we're going to look at my car. I think my last vlog clip is me going, it could be good, it could be bad. Of course it's bad, it's always bad. Mitch will come home and show me some photos. And I cried, and of course it's bad, it's always bad when it comes to cars. It's always bad. So, it's bad. <laughs> we're going to see it later. Hopefully I can show you some like clips. I'll take a couple of little video clips of like what it's, what's going on. It's pretty bad. It's gonna cost me a, more than I wanted to spend. I mean, the original quote that I got for like the two little bits that we asked for was really cheap anyway. And I was ready to like pay way more than what they had quoted me. But now it's gonna be like, way, way more. Although I have put, I have been, I was shopping last night. There's a shop nearby that does like, like vans, campers, that sort of stuff. They do all the like old Volkswagen. What's the word I'm looking for? I don't know. They do old Volkswagen stuff anyway. And I was looking on their website at all the stuff. They do loads of like replacement panels and like all the bits that I might need. So I was looking, I was just putting loads of shit into a list that you can do like shopping lists. I made a wish list of like just stuff that I thought it probably needs. So that came to about 550 quid. And I only added like maybe half the stuff that I'm will probably need. But I added two different lots of heater channels because I wasn't sure which one it was. So it's probably gonna be around the 500 quid anyway, because when you like add the other stuff that I haven't added on, we're gonna find out whether it's gonna be like a whole body off job. It probably is. And Mitchell said like, he can take like a week off work and go down to the unit and help out and stuff. And I'm happy to do that as well. I'm happy to go down my days off and like just offer a helping hand. Although 
I don't know what I'm doing, <laughs> but it's fine. Just the whole point of buying a project car is to like, you know, work on the project. I haven't got up to much today. I'm going to put this washing away in a moment because it's pissing me off. I need to hang up my coat over on the other hook. And I was thinking about putting the shelf up because I haven't showed you the shelf. So let's go to that. So it's like this. This bit obviously goes onto the wall and then it's a cat bed on top and a shelf at the bottom. This bit comes off. It's velcroed on. I didn't stain this bit like underneath because it's gonna have the bed on it and like we're not really gonna be able to see it we're gonna mostly be able to see the underside from like when you sit on the sofa and stuff and walk around the room so i mean you can tell but also like you can't really tell mitchell wants to put it lower down than when i want what i want to put it i want to put it quite high up because anakin keeps trying to jump really high up and i think it's like a it's like a cat thing they like to be high up so they can see over you know the room so I want to put it kind of higher. Mitchell wants to put it a bit lower so they don't struggle to get to it, but I don't think they'll struggle either way. Now I might try and hang this up. I might just mark some holes in the wall like where I kind of want to put it. In fact, I'm going to put the tripod up on my side and you can you can give me your thoughts. Although I might hang it this week and it might be in the vlog, but <laughs> you can give me your thoughts either way. So this is the wall. They've obviously got like this, the cat bench thing and the banister. So I wanted to put it like up here so they can jump from the banister over. But Mitchell wants it lower so they can jump up from here. But I think something sort of in the middle, maybe there, would be good. Like I kind of wanted to put it like way higher up. Like here maybe? I don't know if that's too high from the cat shelf thing, which is like by my butt. And that still might be quite, like it's quite high. I think it's high enough. Maybe I'll bring it out a bit more, I don't know. A bit more in to the corner. What do you lot think? This is really heavy, we're gonna try to hold it up. Hi, we've just got to the place where my car is, so let you know how bad it is when we get there. Hi, welcome to the underneath of my car. This is all of the rust. So some of these panels were just not attached together at all, including the hinge for the door, which has completely fallen and rotted away. There's just parts that were just sort of folded together. This is the um, frame head plate, which we are going to completely replace along with both the floor pans, even though they're not in too bad condition. It is better just to replace them anyway. Um, as you can see, there's quite a lot of rust around the car. Um, I'm not too worried about surface rust, but there's some really big patches like this one just here in the rear uh, wheel well. And I've also got an oil leak, which is great. Hello. I am just leaving the petrol station. I'm in traffic. It's fun. There we go. Uh, I'm on my way to Beth's. Well, I'm actually on my way to Beth's mum's house. Sorry, the sun's really bright. When I get around the corner, it'll be better. <laughs> I've got my blue, like, blocking glasses on because... Oh, my food's going everywhere. Because my eyes really hurt at the moment. And Joe from work was saying how blue light blocking glasses help with, like, LED lights. Like, when you're driving at, like, night and stuff. And most cars have, like, running lights as well. And they're, like, the light from it hurts your eyes. So I'm going to try wearing these while I'm driving and see if it helps. So obviously it doesn't affect my driving at all. But yeah, I'm going to Beth's mum's and we are going to go to uh, London again today. I was going to say the Big Apple, but that's New York, isn't it? <laughs> yeah, we're going to go to London and yeah, do our usual, find stuff to do. It's a Saturday today as well, so it's going to be busier and there's going to be lots more people, which is not good. We don't like that, but it is what it is. It's fine. Oh, what average speed check. Oh, they're putting the barrier back on. Fuck living in Ashford. I hate living in Ashford because of this. They put this fucking barrier on for Brexit and it's just... Mm. There's cameras the whole way so you have to actually do 50. Which is such a pain in the arse. It's going to slow me down so much. Okay, right, I'm going to go listen to some music and eat some crisps and chocolate. Uh, so I'll see you when I get to Beth's mum's. <laughs> Bye. Hi, hello. Beth's on the floor doing her um, hair. I've put my hair up out of the way to when I do my makeup and look how it's left like separated. <laughs> so... We've got a side fringe today, but that's fine. <laughs> just sits a bit weird. We haven't really got a plan. We're going to go to this like conservatory thing, see some plants. Hello. There's a pianist there. When Beth said it in her voice not earlier, I thought she said penis. Hello. Hello. We're just on our way to London now. As per usual. Why are they going um, for me? It's 15, dickheads. I'm sorry, but there's just traffic. I'm going to slow drive down. Yeah, we're just getting to the bit where it's 50 miles an hour on the A2 and it's going to be annoying. They are helping though. Right? That's going to be annoying. I think they're helping. Right. I have to do this. All right, maybe we'll just vlog when we're there and we're not driving. <laughs> Going to the barbecue conservatory. Can I hope we get in. Time is it? Should be still open. Uh, yeah, and then we're going to find some food and some alcohol. Hi, hello. Yeah, like I've said, we're on DLR now, and um, yeah, we're going to 
see some plants. Thank you very much. <laughs> closing and we're gonna escape escape and go home <laughs> there's like makeup on this mirror and everything is kind of disgusting and it smells really bad in here so time to go That's i thought you saw as well i'm like singing all night let's say singing and screaming hi i wasn't talking i was just I gonna do lost, little montage ignore the sweaty because i have lost <laughs> i dropped my powder i'm really upset it's fine i've got a voucher <laughs> i was i was just gonna do a um montage bit i wasn't gonna talk because my microphone's not plugged in Oh, I did say that, you just carried on talking. <laughs> <laughs> <Where are you>? <laughs> <laughs> oh my god. We're um, completely blissfully unaware just now when I recorded the last video that Beth's bag had fallen off the bike and it had all her stuff, her phone, her car keys, everything. It was just on the floor next to a bus stop and luckily no one had picked it up in the five minutes that we are just ridden down the road. That's time around and come back. Oh, no. <laughs> <laughs> what a fiasco.